Hey YouTube, how's everybody doing? It's Ippy G here. And what I want to do in the first 90 seconds of this video is show you how to set up S-Log on your Sony Alpha camera. Initially, when I first got this camera, I looked all over YouTube on how to do it. I couldn't find one that was quick and to the point. So, here it is. Okay. Just set it up. Hit menu. What you're gonna do is you're gonna go to your first pane, the camera pane. Then you're gonna go to page five. Now on page five, you're gonna see where it says picture profile. You're gonna scroll down there. Once you're in picture profile, it's real easy. So once you're here in this menu, you can choose any of these other picture profiles here. I normally just choose one. And all you're gonna do is you're gonna tap right on your little track wheel. And once you do, see gamma, click it. The default setting is up here in movie. All you're gonna do is bring it down. And you can see there's a bunch of profiles there. And S-Log 2. And that's it. It's hidden, but it's simple. And there you have it. S-Log on your Sony camera, which is great for video. And the point without really getting into all the details, specifics, the nitty gritty difference when you do color grading on your video editing. And now, if you've stuck around this long, the rest of the footage that you're about to see is what I recorded on the release of the Nintendo launch. Now, what I didn't know about the Sony camera, specifically the one I have, the A6300, is that it overheats when it does video. So what ends up happening is that the video ends abruptly. Well, if you wanna see the moment leading up to the Nintendo Switch, then check it out. Hope you like it. Hey guys! Hi! I, I think I have chairs in the car. I'm like, because Anya's tired. <laughs> How's it been? Um, I've been here since like 6 six fifteen. It's crazy. Yeah, because I had class, so I came after class. Oh, that's right. Tickets! Oh, dude, I remember like it was like a little... 